Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we are in the room with the cult god D-Bear. Now I'm really excited for this video. D-Bear is a longtime friend. I've been playing with him for just about two years in Brawl Stars now. I've known him really, really well and he's just an absolute god on cult. He's probably over time along with Jack just been the best cults of all time. Um, Dylan is just absolutely amazing. He's unreal. Um, he's just he's he's just like literally god with Cole. There's no other way I can put it. And Cole is one of the flashiest best brawlers in the game, 100%. Definitely one of the most fun. So the fact that he's a god with him is just super super cool. He's got a lot of cool plays. He also has a YouTube. So I'm gonna leave the link for his YouTube in the description below. Um, a lot of these channels as of late, like just plain Mortis channels, Colt channels, are starting to pop off. And I think he's just such an underrated Colt. Not many people know about him. So definitely hit up his channel, give him some subs. I would love to see if he can hit 1,000 subs just based off of our video. That would mean the world to him and to myself, obviously, as well. But what we're going to be doing is we're going to be first showing you a montage. So with that being said, this is going to be an amazing montage. Let's show you guys this and just watch these three minutes of pure domination. Yeah. Okay guys, so we're in the VC now with Dylan. Dylan, what's up? How are you? What's up, Bob? Um, yeah, so I'm super excited to have you on the channel. As I already told all the viewers, you know, we've been friends for literally two years now. We've played the game since way, way, way back. So we got a couple of questions here we're going to ask you. So we're going to start off with number one. Tell us a little bit about yourself. When did you start playing Brawl Stars? What are some of your accomplishments, etc.? Well, yeah, I'm Dylan and I started like two years ago. I met you when I was like 3k and I mean I'm a cult one trick I got I was number one cult for like most of beta and I got all the way to like 941 when I was plus two right so if you guys don't know 941 was a huge deal back in the day it was like plus two and plus one for a win and then like minus 10 for a loss it was something crazy like that so getting to the 900s was insane 1k was basically unheard of 
I remember Dylan at one point had like the number one crow and number one colt in the world, which was literally like impossible back in the day. So that was really just godly. So question number two, when did you first realize that you were a god colt? Um, man, I don't know. It was a little bit after Brawl Ball started, when Golem started playing with me. And like he, he would only play with me and we, I mean, we, we would win like we would do the, we would get the green glitch a lot. So I mean, that's when I started realizing. Right. That was good. Right. I remember back in the day, um, for those of you who don't know how matchmaking works, what happens is someone would make, you'd be in a band. So for example, I'm in Space Station Gaming and when I host the room, that means nobody else who, uh, who hosts in Space Station Gaming can go up against me. It's a strategy that a lot of people use to push trophies and the first time that was really abused was back when Brawl Ball was created and Dylan and Gollum who was a pro mortis would make a band and literally everyone who played Brawl Ball and who wanted to just streak would join it. Everyone was afraid to beat or to face them because there's just no way you were beating them. So number three, so tell us a little bit about your channel. Uh, what type of stuff do you post? How regularly? Uh, just go ahead with that. Uh, yeah, well, I wanted to start a channel because like not that many people make cult videos like only Zar and Mali but like they mainly make Mortis videos yeah but uh like I post Monday Wednesday Friday is what I'm trying to do and then like I release like whole hi cult highlights like once a week and then the other two videos I just try to come up with something creative right and I, it's it's really rare for me to watch Brawl, uh, Brawl Stars on YouTube sometimes I'll watch like Kairos or Corey um when it comes to learning some information about updates because i know nothing about anything all the time but I'll, i definitely go on i watch all of dylan's videos they're they're like there's stuff i can't do in dylan's videos it's just it's really really cool um so now on to more of just like cult questions for the viewers so they can try and learn how to be a cult god so what modes do you push cult on and what modes do you avoid to push cult on Brawl Ball is definitely the main mode to push cult on and i would say heist is the second best mode Mm -hmm. Siege and Bounty are like decent for Colt, but only a few maps are like really good for him. Mm -hmm. And then Gem Grab is just, nah, I wouldn't try. Would you recommend Showdown with Colt? I don't play Showdown. I have like less than 200 Showdown. <laughs> <laughs> so, <yeah>. Relatable. <laughs> yeah. um, in your opinion, which is the best star power? Uh, definitely the second one. The first one's only good in like some maps, like maybe like Triple Dribble, because it's not like a long range map. Mm -hmm. It's like a lot of boxes, so it's like good to be able to run around fast. Right, for sure. Um, and which brawlers do you try and stay away as when you're playing Colt? Stay away from, sorry, when you're playing Colt. Def definitely like Sandy, Poco, MZ, it's just... You kind of have to stay back and just tap them from far away, because if they get too close to you, I mean, there's not much you can really do. Right, and you're trying to approach things like tanks, so like Franks and Bulls and stuff like that. Yeah, and Spike. Spike is probably my favorite to face. Mm -hmm. It's like, so easy to laser. Right, right. So going on to the final part now. So besides you, who do you think are the best Colts in the game? Definitely Chepa too. Like, I, I learned a lot from him and like playing against him. Mm -hmm. And Jaden too. I think he's really good. Mm -hmm. And probably I would say Zar is also right. a good Colt. Right. I'd say God. also Crying Man. Mm -hmm. He's pretty legit, but like he pushed with like Sandy and BB to get stuff. <laughs> Same with Min Wong. I don't know about Min Wong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said I said at the start of the video that probably in my opinion the two best Colts when it comes to how often they've been the best and for how long are probably you and Jack neck and neck because you guys have always just been amazing Colts. Oh, and Johnny Boy, but he's like dead right now. Yeah. <laughs> Johnny Boy was definitely amazing, but unfortunately doesn't play the, the game much anymore. So last question, is there anything you want to, anything or anybody that you want to shout out at all? Um, yeah. Just anything. Yeah, a couple of my homies wanted a shout out, so definitely Chepa too, Jaden, Mally, mm -hmm. uh, Pika, and, and Greenwell. Those are my boys. Oh yeah, those guys are all gods. Anyways, yeah. thank you for your time and for, you know, the montage, the interview and everything. Um... That, you know, obviously it was a great interview. I don't do it a lot, but when, when you made a YouTube and I, I was super happy to help out, I, I don't really have this part of gameplay on my channel. So it was really, really huge that you, you know, have a channel and you're able to work with me. So anyways, thank you for that. And yeah, I guess that's going to be it for now. Thank you for the quad, bro. 
definitely gonna help start my YouTube channel out. For sure, guys. Make sure you guys check out his YouTube, as I said at the start of the video. It's absolutely godly. You guys will learn a lot and see a lot of cool plays. And just by seeing things, you guys are gonna be able to learn it. So definitely check it out. But that is gonna be it. I will catch you guys later. Peace.